Progressive technological developments show that direct current applications were limited by the complexity of current transfer even over short distances. Therefore, the electric power industry shifted focus on alternate current systems. This was a new step towards transformed power supplies. Already in 1882, the French scientist Lucien Goulard and his English colleague John Gibbs developed an induction coil or transformer. It was also called the second regenerator. This was a device used to convert alternate current electric energy. Such a generator covered high electric current of low voltage into low current of high voltage and vice versa. The generator consisted of a wooden stand housing some vertical induction coils. Their primary windings were series connected. Their secondary windings were divided into sections. Each section had a pair of outputs used to connect current receivers. They operated independently of each other. Inductive coils had pull-out cores. They regulated voltages applied on secondary windings. Cores of primary and secondary windings were not interconnected. This means the transformers had an open magnetic system. Transformers were employed in AC wire transmission equipment that transmitted alternating current electric energy over long distances. Principles invented by Gallard and Gibbs further underpinned the development of AC transformers.